Hi guys, so this is the second version of the cable for uh, connecting the Lilligo that runs the BYD battery emulator software uh, to the Tesla Model 3 and Y battery pack. So uh, this has an additional OBD2 port that I wired in. All of this is completely optional. You don't need that if you're just trying to run the Lilligo. But I like to use that for scan my Tesla. Uh, what's missing in this one that I had in the first one is the power supply uh, connection to the battery, I mean. So uh, the way I'm connecting the battery now is just just to the PCS directly. These two connect to the PCS and then the battery 12 volt also connects to the PCS via separate wires. Uh, and then the power supply for the wheel though, I don't have that uh, here. I've been just using a 9 volt uh, battery to provide power over here or a computer to provide power over here. But in the future, I'm gonna use, just like what I've had in the version one, I'm gonna use a DC-DC converter to output five volts. What's new in this version is this relay. And uh, I added that so that if something happens to the Lily Go and uh, the power is cut to it, for example, I want the contactors to, uh, to open in that case, to disconnect the battery. Um, I just don't feel comfortable having the contactors be uh, closed if the Lily Go can't monitor the, the voltages and stuff like that. So the way this relay works is I wired in, it in to the Lily Go. Uh, this, is, this goes to the ground and uh, both of these go to a uh, five volt power. So I'll use that as the power and as the signal. And that's how they're wired in. So as long as Lily Go is getting power, these are gonna get power. In the future, of course, this could be programmed so that we would go with a turn these on right before sending the, the signal to close the contactors, but I think that's kind of an overkill for now. Everything else is the same. If you're gonna wire one of these, uh, follow this diagram. Somebody online made this, uh, props to them. So uh, these, uh, well, actually, let's start here. The black one, black thick wire, goes to ground, then yellow and uh, brown thick ones. They're wired directly to the relay. Uh, they're getting... Uh, disregard that. <laughs> I need to uh, redo that connection there. Uh, but they're wired to relay over here. And this is actually going straight to 12 volt. This, this just turn around, turns around here and goes goes here. Uh, and 12 volt also gets passed on. I think it's, uh, I think it's these two, I don't remember now. Yeah, I think these two, no, these two are ground. I think 12 volt is this one. But anyway, uh, yeah, so that's 12 volt power and ground. And then uh, the red, and uh, kind of light purple ones. They go to the 120 ohm resistor. And, uh, and then these two, green and black, they are wired to high and low on OBD2. And uh, then these two, brown with white stripe and brown, are uh, connected to the can go and high on a Lily Go. By the way, these have different colors and different batteries, so don't go off by the color. They change from battery to battery. And uh, yeah, that's it for the wiring here. The rest are unused. Click that on. Yeah, and then I'm gonna put these in a box or shrink wrap or something. And uh, yeah, if this video is helpful to someone, please leave a comment. Thank you.